So if you talk about keyboard shortcuts, you might know some. For example, if I were to go around type here, then if I were to press Ctrl C, then it copies out the text. I can press Enter and press Ctrl V. So this makes the work much more easier. And if you want to know what shortcut keys the uh, Word, WordPad app, application provides, you can go over here on to paste and then uh, hover over and you can see Control V is there. So paste Control V is there. So it shows up right there. You can also go around and then hover over onto other tools right here. So you can you know that for cut it's Control X, for copy it's Control C and so forth. You can go around right here. If there's any shortcut keys, it'll show up right there. So for example, for find, it's control F. For replace, it's control H. For select all, it's control A. Similarly, uh, there's no shortcut keys for this one, as you can see. In the view, you can see that there's zoom out and everything. So as long as there's shortcut keys, usually what happens is that they'll pop up right there. So you go around over here. So around into new, hover over, there's control N. Press open, control O, save is control S, and there's save as. If I were to hover over, there's no shortcut key for that one. Print is control P, and there's no for page setup, and not, not the one for exit, as you can see. On the top, if you were to click on it, you even have more options to control the application. And that is how you can view and then know the keyboard shortcuts so that you, uh, so that you can use them easily inside of WordPad. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.